We're gonna start off today's uh -huh. tutorial video with a close-up shot of Tyler here. He and Darren are going to show us how to take this amazing design that Tyler has created, and he and Darren have together uh, created a tool path for using that glorious cam tab. Uh, so Darren, Tyler, you wanna walk us through what you're gonna do to get this ready to run on the amazing, wonderful Haas mill? Okay, so once you have it all canned up, ready to go, Yep. Um, you'll generate to make sure everything's up to date. We'll ask you if you want to, and you say yeah. And let's do its work. You'll be happy. Then you just hit post process. Up there in the left, top left, okay. Yep. And, and this is where you have to like choose the mill, right? Yep, and then right here, you hit the down arrow. Usually it's gonna be up here on this one. No. You'll have to click it, you'll go down, you'll find Haas, pre-NGC Haas. No A, no nothing, just that. Okay, we, I see it. Okay that. And you can just hit post, and it'll ask you where you wanna save it. Okay. So once you have your USB drive in there, you just find it, and then you name it what you want. And then you just click save. Okay. And now we're ready to go plug that flash drive into the Haas and run the part, right? We'll actually pull it up like this and you can actually see the code, yep. what's actually saved. Um, you can run through it, make sure everything looks good. Make sure there's nothing weird. A Make sure you got your coolant turning on, for instance, and stuff. A lot of a lot of times you want to look at the Z minimum. So this is how far the part's going, or the tool's going into the part. Make sure that's not like, at like four inches. If that's at four inches, you got something wrong. Yeah, Go and then you're risking it. running into your vice or doing yep. something crazy. If that's all good, then we're ready to go out to the hop. Awesome. That was easy. Way to go, guys. Thanks, Tyler. Wow. Wow, <laughs> <laughs>